Welcome to another edition of the Civ Battle Royale. My name is Dawkins, and let's get right into part 110, Dr. Strange Pedro, or How I Learned to Stop Worrying and Love the Carnival. This part is done by user Poetic Poblano, and it's a real treat if you're into haiku, because the entire part is in haiku. If you don't like it, blame user Poetic Poblano for all of that. If you do like it, it's me. I did it. Thanks. A Worldwide Boer Reich. 12 million paratroopers. Worldwide Brazil Reich. Inuit death comes. Nuclear hell consumes all. War never changes. Once Mexican land. No longer Mexicans here. Only Carnival. Puebla, Mexico. Found where serpents change their skin and where XCOMs land. Here lies Albany, tombstone of Lincoln himself, reads, let freedom ring. No turtle ships now, nor Huacha for Sejong, no units at all. Pax Siberia, when Jaku Sky slept in peace. The sleep is gone now. The Boar Capital, but only penguins live here. The Boars are dead. <laughs> Cincinnati Falls, a world renowned city falls. Lol, JK, who cares? Not Brazil loses, a city to not Brazil, and more will follow. Peaceful ocean gulf, no nuclear fallout here, ancient citadels. Blackfoot Torreon, then Inuit Torreon, Brazil Torreon. No buck embargo, free trade for all anarchists, severe carpeted. No more OCP, no more Boer containment, no more Boer Reich. Do you remember? Mexico once laid claims here. Mexico is dead. Yeah, that's right, bitch, because the Blackfoot got him. Oh, sorry, I broke character for a second. Sorry. Nothing to lose here. Nothing to win here, either. Morgan is alone. Inuit collapse. Omae wa mu shindaru. Nani? Inuit. 50 words for snow, yet no words for a defeat. No need until now. New York has fallen. Was the carnival worth it? Billions have now died. Oh no, that's me. War torn Rakdia. Low health for eternity. No peace in our time. Nothing happens here, and yet everything happens. I'm very confused. End Korean War. 
and Vietnam has no soul. Rak Dia is free. One-sided peace deals, Vietnam's main specialty. At least 10 cities. Vietnam, Sabir. 10 screenshots of a bad war. Nothing happens here. Brazil loses troops. Now, this could have meant something. But Inuit, dumb. God died long ago. We killed him with Carnival. <laughs> Quiet Joinville. Now, population zero. Brazil killed them all. Winnipeg is bad. Their hockey team isn't good. Zero playoff wins. Now, that's a burn. Nothing happens here. It's the curse of Yakusha. Jakusky is cursed. Egads, my roast is ruined. But what if I were to purchase fast food? Inuit fight back, but it will be Brazilian. Carnival won't stop. Charlottetown Falls. D-E-L-E-T-E-B. R-A-Z-I-L. Spells delete Brazil. Sabir is next. Hide your children, hide your wife. Carnival's coming. Poland is dead. They've been dead for a while. They're dead in sea bricks. Unpronounceable. Can't fit it in a haiku. Zero out of ten. Thank God. Want to see the world? Then book a carnival cruise. <laughs> Druzina now flips, but it might flip back next turn. Life is meaningless. You forgot this war. That's okay, I did it too. Boars forgot too. Vancouver, Brazil. Quaint Atlantic coastal town. None of this is real. Druzina flipped back, but it might flip back next turn. Life is meaningless. Unreadable town with countless syllables. Why do you exist? No revive today. Sitting Jesus, please come back. Cylinder needs you. Druzina flips here, but it might flip back next turn. Life is meaningless. I mean, there's lots of meaning in life. Please don't. Don't make this an ASMR thing or something like that. Life has meaning to it. There's plenty of things like dogs. Dogs are angels blessed upon the human race for us to have the privilege of picking up their poop. That, that is a blessing. That gives life meaning. Tabriz builds units. It will take six turns to build and six turns to die. Eric Carlson. He can't save you anymore. Ottawa is done. Druzina stays gray. Another city falls too. 
It might flip back though. Must be lonely here, in this desolate ice town. Six million penguins. It's over, Kruger, says Emperor Pedro II. I have the high ground. Unpronounceable. Why can't the Blackfoot settle cities with real names? Now listen, I might get a little feisty with Sweden for their silly crap that they pull, but don't get on my Blackfoot, okay? Let them have their beautiful language and be happy. More Sioux cities. Sioux cities fall left and right. What is this, part nine? All hope is lost now. The carnival claims one more. Life is pain. I hate. Iceland wants more ice. They'll take it from the Boers. Maximum Iceland. The Boer fleet sails. They were prepared for this war. Carriers will die. The end of the part. Blame Poblano for haikus. Vote Millard Fillmore. Okay, I guess that was part 110. Um, yeah, that was a neat experiment. That was some haikus. That was some haikus, so yeah. But for real though, so this has been a really interesting part because a couple of things happened. First, the Inuit were put up to this standard of being able to stop Brazil and North America at the very least. They were the last hope. With the southern part of the United States being deleted in part 109, there was some hope that, oh, maybe the Bucks might fall out, or maybe Iceland would get involved, or maybe somebody would get involved, and the Inuit could push back. They could hold Brazil for, for any reasonable amount of time, but they have just crumbled completely. This is very sad to see. This, I, I don't know how many more parts of Mark II there are going to be. I mean, if we're going for total domination, I suppose a handful, maybe, maybe five? Uh, but that's what this is all about. I mean, there's going to be one winner, and it seems that Brazil has got it hands down. Although we did say that about the Boers, but this, this is, this is out of control. Brazil is at their highest of highs. They are beyond anything that the Boers ever were, so it's... It's their game to take. Uh, if you have been interested in this stuff and you still want to see more of it, the CBR won't be over in, in say, the five parts that I, I suggested it would be. CBRX, the Seabricks, or wherever you want to call it. That is going to be the next part, the next iteration of the Civ Battle Royale. We have voting going on in the sub right now. You can find a link to that in the comments. Unless you're listening to this much later on in the future, and I'm an old man or dead, and this is playing at my funeral, participate. Be a part of r slash Civ Battle Royale on Reddit, and have your voice heard. Have some of these cool civs that you want to see in Asia and Australia and North and South America prosper in this next iteration of the Mark CBRX. But until then, please like and subscribe if you like this, even if you didn't like it. Uh, we'll try better next time, but until then, we'll see you next time.